Yeah, what's up everyone? Welcome to my YouTube channel at Moses the Journalist. It is a wonderful evening. Ah uh, no, not really in the evening, but then it is in the afternoon in uh, uh, Kenya, Africa here. Yeah, this specific place uh, uh, that I am at, it's a, a Banda area because Banda area has begun from this place right from the river that is river Kitembe that has divided Banda area and the Kitembe area or the Banda, Banda village and Kitembe village so the, the river Kitembe has divided the two villages yeah so specifically where I am at this particular moment it is a Banda area wow so you also gear, uh, enjoy the adventure of Banda yeah, also that I show you what is also happening uh, in Banda area. Like right now where, where I am, I'm still on the way to Banda Center. I haven't reached the Banda Center. Yeah, by the way, today it's so, it is so uh, lovely because today you can see here with me, I have, the, I have these are uh, two pairs of socks. You see? Yeah, this one because I'm going for uh, a match. Because so I once told you, you people, that I'm also a footballer. You see? Yeah, I'm going for a match. Yeah, then you can ask me where, where are the boots, but then I have some there up. I'm gonna use, yeah. So I'm going, that is a Banda, uh, uh, specifically Banda uh, uh, Center or the place where we're gonna play or we're gonna have our match is Banda uh, 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 Primary School. That is the place. Yeah, so before I did the place or before I play the match, maybe because I won't, I won't manage to show you the match. And maybe the match maybe can take uh, uh, some uh, to say maybe around one hour 50 minutes around there and then maybe it can now be late so i would just like to give you uh, some good adventure of how banda also looks like uh, like the area before uh i before the match is kicked off yeah so that is uh, that is it i'm just uh, uh, welcoming each and every person with uh, I'm welcoming you into my YouTube channel that you may stay tuned in watching my videos and like, yeah, because the videos here I hear are interesting and the more days we go, the more we make interesting videos. The more we go and uh, the more I explore much, the more I make interesting videos just for you. So it's um, a plea request that you watch and you also share my videos to the to other medias yeah so so here is the the banda you can see there down there that, that is river kitembe let me zoom it for you so you can see it yeah that is river kitembe and then i am here now this this road here adds to banda yeah banda center by the way you can see how this road looks like yeah this is the road that i when i was still in banda like um in 2019 2020 when i was still uh, and 2021 when i was still uh, studying at banda uh, secondary school this is the part that i was uh, I, I used to use when i was going to school because but then i was a day scholar so i had to use this part this part that you are seeing here this road that you are seeing here. and then yeah you can wonder that why is this road like uh, somehow uh, deep and and rocky yeah, because this is because of the the floods or i can say because of it, it has been eroded this place has been eroded and that is the reason as to because the water or uh, the water that flows right up from uh, banda center all that water you know they must look for a way to the the river source you see and the river source is there down there down you see yeah and now they have to follow to get uh, a route to the river source yeah so that is the reason as well you can see this that this rocky place is somehow slopey as it does uh let me let me say it is it is eroded somehow eroded wow you can see that is how it is yeah so this was the road that i, I used when i was still studying at banda uh, high school wow mm -hmm. Wow, so enjoy Banda area, you see, yeah, they also, uh, I told you that sugarcane is everywhere, you see, by the, uh, this one I'll be showing you maybe almost every day, those who are watching my videos for the first time, you have to also enjoy uh, seeing 
the sugar cane yeah though the sugar cane that is there that one is still little they haven't grown that much but then they're still upcoming yeah and then uh, some are here like that one that you see there that one is ready to be harvested the sugar cane that you see there yeah uh yeah those who do not know maybe sugar cane because there are some people differentiate i'm not talking about this this is uh cassava and then sugar cane is there the other side there yeah that is it sugar cane that is how it is yeah so this is the the way to banda uh, center because specifically right now i'm already at banda area i should not be talking that this is the way to banda area because i'm already at banda area yeah wow. by the way it's not that uh, oh this is weeding that was taking place and someone has just uh, put uh, the weeds on the way here you see yeah, and this one I know it will block even, but then this can this can't block the, the water flowing because if if it comes with a, uh, a big current, then uh, with a lot of force, then it cannot block it. Uh. Mm -hmm. And that was weeding that was taking place somewhere in someone's garden. Wow, you can also enjoy looking around. Someone has has done the banana plantation is here a mixed cropping with a yeah uh -huh. you see and the, the, the banana plantation and also the cassava so it's kind of a mixed mixed farming yeah the person has mixed with the, the crops yeah. let me come up to this point again i show you yeah you see banana is there and also a cassava and also the potato was there down yeah and you see how the, 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 they have now done this road like this one now this place now because it is a it has been eroded now they use banana this banana i can say banana trees yeah the logs of the bananas let me use the log the logs of the bananas they put them on the road so that this place can be uh somehow a little bit easier to pass you see yeah uh. Now let me bring you to a real sugarcane plantation, the one that has done well, yeah, because it depends with the garden, or it also depends with the with the the criteria that the criteria that you use, yeah, that is what will make a good production of of uh, maybe of what you want, yeah, like planting sugarcane. Wow, look at this place again, but then it's looking not not looking good because. They even put the, the, the banana roots, the roots of the banana here, all over. That can prevent the, the water flowing here. But then water will not, it will still flow. Wow. You can see. Ooh. So you have to pass here with, with a little bit because it is now slippery. Wow. See here, look at here. You see now a good sugar cane. This one is now healthy. Yeah, and the production is good. The yield that it go it 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 go it it has a good yield, yeah. Meaning this one, the one of this you can plant plantation, shall have gotten a lot of money here, yeah. Because the sugarcane has done well. By the way, the the higher the sugarcane does well, that is the higher the person who sells it earns. Yeah, that is it. He has done well, and then. Uh, it is in a small, in a small place, yes. But then, he, the criteria that he has used is so good. Because for you to um, make something good, you have to, uh, uh, like this one, you have to uh, use a lot of money in making something good like this, so that you can produce a good sugar cane like this. He has to go extra mile in maybe buying the fertilizers, treating the sugar cane very well. And weeding the sugar cane frequently up to this point that the sugar cane has now reached, which will now earning good money. And then you have also to do some fencing, like he has done some fencing here, so that the cattle cannot interfere with the with the, with the sugar cane plantation. Well, and then on this other side also, I'm seeing a good flowers that someone has planted. Wow, 
that one is someone's home of which i should not be showing uh because it is under principles you see yeah someone's place is under principles of which if you, you if I, I cannot just be showing camera like that yeah that one it is uh, lawful wow yeah so uh, because it is uh, still a little bit far banda center yeah so stay tuned and I know um, if I read the place, then I'll be showing you again. Yeah. Wow. So I'm at uh, specifically at this place here. This is a two-way road because you can see there's another one, another way going down there, and another one that I was using that one there. And then I'm now gonna use this one up to Banda Center. And then it's a good thing because there wasn't a, a good road here, but the government now has ensured that there be a good road here yeah it was level as well and uh, it was put in a good condition and then by now uh, some grass have already grown uh, on the road but then i know uh, if god willing the government shall do something again so that it also looks good as it was looking good before well so you can see look at where i was from the other side up to here wow yeah so this is the way uh now to banda i'm from the the, the a narrow road but i'm now from i'm now in a, a little bit a wider a wider road now that is heading to banda yeah yeah so finally i'm here at banda uh, center wow you can see over there that is uh, a little factory uh, like a small factory not little little factory but it's a small factory there is where let me show you because i once showed you this thing uh, in one of my videos but then it wasn't here but then what a uh, lovely thing that is happening here is that also some the like um, making the so-called jaggery yeah that is used in processing uh, the sugar it's also being done here you see yeah and uh, oh this place here you can see the the what has been made there that hole it's what is being used as a cooking like uh for putting the firewood and then it is not firewood they use these circuses yeah i don't want to show it much because i'd shown it earlier before and then this is now banda center yeah uh, wow so this is how uh, like banda center you can see this is now banda center and then the field uh, is over here i'm just gonna show you what has, re has been written yeah yeah so like uh, uh you can see there uh, the tank that has been put here but this way by the way this is government's implementations there is a government's work because uh, it is the government that has done all this to ensure that also the school has uh, plenty of water yeah you can see there it is written banda primary school Maranguru. yeah so it is funded by the C cdf you see the financial here is 2021 2022 that is the year that this uh, like the tank and that you see over there was made yeah so this is uh, uh like right now i'm uh, in banda prima yeah, so wonderful people i was uh showing you this particular place before my phone interrupted me yeah so uh, like i was telling you this place here uh these are uh, the, the tank that you see there up uh that one it was brought here by the government of kenya you see how the government did a wonderful uh job here and by the way it is using it is a kind of it's a solar system it is using the solar you see yeah the water was drilled from that from down yeah it was drilled from down let me show you yeah this particular place is where the water was drilled from yeah it was drilled here down yeah and now just been connected that way up the tank there up you see the pipe that is moving yeah so it's moving from here you see this green pipe yeah that is how the water is running 
like this like this up to that uh, tie, pipe there until uh, it reaches up uh, to the tank yeah and you can see even the water some some droplets of the water that means that the water here it's uh, uh, the water uh, it's uh, in the tank in plenty yeah so the government has done a good job you see those are the the, the, the solars that are there yeah oh. so that, that that is what is helping in uh, uh, generating that water from uh, down here to the pipe there up up the tank yeah. so here again the this is the school field banda uh, primary yeah you can see this is Banda Primary School. Wow. Mm -hmm. Th there up, those are the buildings. Those are the classes. Let me, like there, you can see. Those are the classes. There is Banda Primary School. And then Banda Secondary School is up. The other side, they're up. Yeah. Wow. And then the school also is fenced. Because you can see, uh, all round is fenced uh, using the, the barbed wires uh, and the poles and then uh, the school is as well surrounded with a, with a, with a, a lot of uh, trees you can see the trees yeah the blue gum tree you see yeah yeah so that is how it is see? Yeah. Oh, and then also here uh, is another uh, place uh, you see this one also we got uh, another another tank is also here it's also placed there yeah this one also takes water to the sea to the uh, because the water that is here it's been supplied in uh, in many places because it's been supplied to the primary school and also it's been supplied to the center yeah because also the, the center people have to use the water that is here yeah so that is the center that you're seeing there that is banda center yeah in within this this place i'm still in the in the school in the, in the school compound yeah i'm still in the school compound and uh, the center is visible from this place and then i'm just gonna show you also the government uh, uh, the uh, good job that the government began but then uh, i don't know due to some maybe uh, unavoidable circumstances i can say so uh, uh what they began to do has not come into completion it has not come into complete yeah yes so that is it you can see the school uh forest that is the center there down yeah where they, it's a small center yeah but then they what they they do the what they sell there they sell a lot of things they are down yeah. Whoa, whoa. yeah so uh, this is the the school ladies yeah oh this is the school bit. and then you can wonder that why does it have why does it not have a good a structure of the gate but then that is the gate of the primary school and then this other way uh, goes to the high school that is the secondary school uh, you can see the building there down there up and the gate that structure that, that gate structure that one is the secondary uh, yeah gate and then what I wanted to show you was this you see uh, the government uh, has tried to do a lot of things to ensure that development uh, happen in between uh, different communities and uh, it's so that uh, at least uh, Migori County because this is Migori County it also develops you see yeah and then you see the water that water tank that I just showed you there yeah it was also to come up to this point you see yeah because now I'm not in the school compound I'm away from the school compound but then it was also to be allocated here some some taps were to be allocated this place here so that it can be used and I want to tell you the reason as to why it was also to be placed here you see yeah some pipes are to be located here so that that water runs from that from that place also to here you can see 
yeah so the reason as to why this this thing was placed here is that uh, we got a, a structure here that you can see here yeah by the way it was a uh, yeah it was a good thought that the government thought of uh, building uh, an hospital here that is a public hospital yeah uh, a small hospital that uh, maybe uh, let me just say let me just call it a dispensary yeah that will help maybe when the when the students or the pupils are sick in the school and then this the hospital here can help yeah for the, they, they can come here for medication and then not only the students or the, not the pupils but then also the community as a whole also they can also get uh, uh, assisted here yeah when someone is sick because we have uh, um, those people that are, that are around more or that are, are around in this area are not many yeah yeah they're not many so you have to go extra mile or you have to go uh, a little bit uh, far far places to reach a good hospital but then someone even can get sick uh, during and night hours and then what can happen that is the reason as why the government brought about this that it can help in building uh, this structure here that will help in helping the health of the, the com Banda community not only Banda but also those who are coming within or closer to Banda can also enjoy the same but then it is so unfortunate that it does not come into complete yeah it had uh, the, 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 the structure by the way it had, it had <coughs> that began constructing it but then it does not come into complete you see it was three rooms if I'm wrong this is the first this is uh that is the first room and you also got and the second room here yeah then it is it has also the third room this other side here yeah so that it was uh, how it is structured but then it is so much unfortunate that it does not come into complete yeah it does not come into complete but then we are also hoping that if uh, possibly if the government uh, will still uh, maybe if the government uh, will still help on this and then uh, good developments will happen to this place yeah and then we will get uh, like banda also who shall have developed having a good dispensary hospital Bit, uh, yeah, closer to them yeah so it will give them an, a little bit a easy time uh, in going to the to seek for medication yeah because seeking for medication by the way health is that much important but then if you don't seek uh, the, the, the not health centers like this one here that were, had begun if it could have come into complete then it would have been a good thing yeah <sighs> Yeah, so one of the people are also forgetting this part here. So, uh, like I, uh, I said, uh, this is the, the, the center, Banda center. So, uh, the water that uh, I showed you, the tanks there up, uh, it is also allocated here. The taps, the two taps that you see here, uh, this one, uh, uh, it helps uh, in, uh, in collecting water uh, in within the, the center here. Yeah, people that are within the center here also enjoy this you see yeah, yeah so that is how it is we are very happy that we have water here oh you can uh, then you can talk me that's how it's here they don't need to talk so uh, that was the update that I, I forgot to, to give you and then that is how it is uh, yeah you can see how that water is running out yeah and also this other tap here so there's a uh, uh, yeah you can see how, that, how it's funny <laughs> yeah so they, <laughs> it's okay yeah so that is how it is, and I enjoy this pleasure. Oh, <laughs> this is how you people you, you, you see yourself in the video. Yeah, yeah. It's fine. Yeah. So that is how it is at Banda Center. Yeah. That is the place that I was just forgetting, but then uh, I, I have also made it out. I made it clear for you. That is this is the center. It's very small, but then uh, activities like selling and uh, buying of the goods must take place because it has, it has already become a center yeah wow. yeah so uh, that is Moses the journalist uh, reporting to you from uh, uh, Banda area today you see yeah so literally uh, what uh, I was just uh, trying to put across or uh, then the, the information that I was trying to pass uh, like when I was showing this structure that is over here yeah 
I'm just trying to uh, pass a, a info, an information that uh, also different communities should get developed things like the the, the like hospitalities and like um, yeah the structures like this like the, those spots yeah they should be taken into more consideration yeah if the government starts to do this then it should come into complete so that it can help Kenyans or it can help the community as a whole yeah so by the way it's still a pre-request uh, from Banda community that this uh, that the structure here to be into complete so that uh, they can uh, get uh, an, an health center yeah so the government uh, that just began this uh, we are so much uh, we are we are appreci appreciative yeah Banda community is appreciative but then they are still asking that this uh, this one should also get into complete yeah because um, uh, health is important that is true and then you know at maybe at night night hours like i just said running from maybe uh, a point like uh, from here to rongo you know it's a distance you see but then if it were that uh, from i can say from maybe from that center to here you see that yeah that one someone can even save life yeah, but then if it is uh, from that, that 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 distance is getting that long, then it uh, someone even can lose the life. I'm sorry to say that, but then we wish that everyone live a good life. No one loses his or her life. But then we should also look into considerations uh, when it comes to building hospitals. Yeah, yeah, especially yeah in different in, in communities, community hospitals. Yeah. Yeah, they should be closer. They should like just dispensaries, which people because this one, by the way, it wasn't it wasn't going for, for any cost. No one was going to pay for this. Yeah. But then that is all. Yeah. So that is all about that. And also, uh, I hope I've shown you some places in Banda area. Yeah. And I hope you have enjoyed seeing and watching. Yeah, so it's just my plea, humble request that you stay tuned to my YouTube channel. That is Moses the Journalist. And please, I'm also uh, appreciating my subscribers who have been with me all along. Yeah, to subscribe to my YouTube channel, watching my, 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 the, my videos, and also commenting to my videos. Thank you, and may God bless you. Stay with the, uh, have the same heart. Yeah, the same heart that you have, the holy heart. And God will always bless you yeah and also do, to those who are discovering my youtube channel for the first time please it is my humble request from my heart that you um, uh, uh, subscribe to my youtube channel comment like share and god will bless you yeah and also do not forget um, my uh, brother otenga jr who is also spreading charity work uh, in the in Kitembe community and also to other places i have to thank him uh, because uh, of his, his commitments, he has been so much committed uh, to spreading the love of God, yeah, and uh, helping uh, various places. So the kind of heart that he has, I know God will also will bless you uh, uh, abundantly. And also to our great supporters, that right now I'm, I'm communicating to Kitembe area or Kitembe village. Our great supporters who have been supporting Kitembe village, uh thank you and may god bless you stay with the same heart of helping so that kitembe village can grow shine and look beautiful more more beautiful yeah and then also uh now to our uh those, those who are helping my home literally my home now i have to say thank you and may god bless you to mena um bravis mom she's also my mom I have also to thank her for being supportive to our home and also to Nyasuba, uh, Uncle D, RD. You people you have been supportive to us and we have to appreciate you, you, know, you and, and may God bless you. And also to our lovely sister Moria. Thank you and God bless you. Wherever you are watching this video from, I am appreciating you for the kind heart and the, 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 the uh, good soul that you have and the holy heart that you have may god bless you uh, you have done a good thing indeed in ensuring that also 
my prayer ladies homestead look uh, amazing and awesome and to shine yeah thank you and uh, also having supported other people like me i have to appreciate you yeah so receive my receive my, my appreciation that is from me moses the journalist yeah and then i know we are still go we are still looking for yonder yonder by the way that is always my wish that i also eat a thousand subscribers i always say that it, it is you who is watching someone else watching somewhere you subscribe to my youtube channel that is a play request that you subscribe to my youtube channel so that i grow all my, my youtube channel also can grow i eat uh, the target of a thousand subscribers yeah that is all from me most of the i just want to say bye bye and may god bless you in a unique way wonderful people wish i mean that is me most of the was reporting to you from kitambe from no no not really kitambe but from banda village i hope you enjoy it and let us prepare again for the next video that is gonna come soon bye bye and let us meet that is me most of the journalist please it's my play request i'm still repeating that is my play request uh that you subscribe to my youtube channel moses the journalist bye bye one love and uh, let us catch up in my next video yeah